Why does dating after 40 seems like a daunting task? It's a question that lingers in the minds of many mature singles. The dating landscape can feel like uncharted territory, filled with its own unique set of challenges and uncertainties. One of these hurdles is societal pressure. We live in a world that often equates age with a ticking clock, creating a sense of urgency that can be both overwhelming and intimidating. But it's important to remember that there's no expiration date on love. The timeline that society imposes on us is not a mandatory rule, but a mere suggestion. Then there's self-doubt, another common obstacle. Past experiences, heartbreaks and periods of solitude can lead to questioning our worthiness of love. But let's debunk this misconception right here, right now. Your past does not define your future, and everyone is deserving of love, regardless of their age or history. Fear of rejection is yet another challenge to grapple with. The thought of putting ourselves out there only to potentially face disappointment can be paralyzing. But rejection is not a reflection of your worth. It's a part of life, a learning experience that helps us grow and become more resilient. And let's not forget the challenge of navigating the dating scene itself. It's changed significantly over the years with online platforms and apps becoming the norm. This shift can be disorienting, but it also brings new opportunities and ways to connect with people. These challenges are real, they're valid, and they're experienced by many, but they're also not insurmountable. They are part of the journey, the path that leads us to growth, self-discovery, and ultimately love. So if you're standing at the precipice of dating after 40, remember this. Age is just a number. It doesn't define your worth, your desirability, or your capacity to love and be loved. It's never too late to find love. The journey may be challenging, but it's also filled with potential for joy, connection, and new beginnings. As we navigate this journey together, let's embrace the challenges, celebrate the victories, and remember love is waiting for you, no matter your age. But remember, age is just a number, and it's never too late to find love. Scene script. First, it's important to redefine what dating means to you. Imagine dating as a journey, a journey of discovery, not just about your potential partner, but also about yourself. This isn't a race to the finish line, but a leisurely stroll through the park. And as we stroll, let's unpack some baggage, shall we? It's crucial to set realistic expectations. This isn't about lowering your standards, but rather understanding that everyone, including yourself, has their own quirks and idiosyncrasies. Perfection is a myth, and chasing it can lead to disappointment. Instead, focus on finding someone who shares your values and vision for the future. As we mature, our relationship goals evolve. In our 20s, we might have sought adventure and passion. In our 30s, stability and shared goals might have taken precedence. Now, in our 40s and beyond, we might seek companionship, understanding, and shared interests. And guess what? That's perfectly okay. Our priorities change as we grow, and our relationships should reflect this growth. What do you want from a relationship now? Companionship, shared hobbies, a travel partner, or perhaps someone to share quiet evenings with? There's no wrong answer here. The key is to be honest with yourself and your potential partner. And here's a liberating thought. You don't need someone to complete you. You're already whole. The notion of our other half can be misleading. It suggests that we are incomplete on our own, which just isn't true. Instead, look for someone who compliments you, who brings out the best in you, and whom you can do the same for. Remember, dating is about finding someone who compliments you, not completes you. And as you embark on this journey, carry with you an open mind, a receptive heart, and the understanding that the dating landscape might look a little different than it did two decades ago. But with these tools in your arsenal, you're well equipped to navigate the world of mature dating. Confidence is key in the dating world, but how do we build it? This is a question that many of us grapple with, especially if we're stepping back into the dating scene after a hiatus. But don't worry, building confidence is a journey, and we're here to guide you through it. First off, engage in activities you enjoy, Nothing boosts confidence like doing something you're good at, something that makes you feel alive. Maybe it's painting, maybe it's hiking, or maybe it's something as simple as reading a good book. When you're engaged in something you love, it shines through, making you irresistibly attractive. Next, practice self-love and acceptance. This is not just about pampering yourself with a spa day or a nice dinner, although those things are important too. 
It's about accepting yourself, warts and all. Recognize your strengths, acknowledge your weaknesses, and remember that you're a work in progress. Embrace who you are, because you are unique, and that's what makes you special. Lastly, focus on personal growth. This might mean picking up a new hobby, learning a new language, or even just trying to be a better listener. Personal growth is all about evolving, about striving to be the best version of yourself. And when you're committed to growth, it shows, it radiates confidence. Remember, confidence isn't about being perfect, it's about being comfortable with who you are. It's about knowing your worth and not being afraid to show it. It's about stepping into a room and owning it. Not because you're the most attractive person there, but because you're the most self-assured. And here's a little secret. Confidence is attractive. It draws people in. It makes them want to get to know you. So as you embark on this journey of building confidence, remember that you're doing it for yourself, but also for the potential partner who is waiting to meet the confident, radiant you. With confidence, you're one step closer to finding your partner. So get out there and let your confidence shine. After all, you're not just looking for love, you're looking for a partnership that celebrates you for you, and that begins with confidence. Expanding your social circles can open up new avenues for potential partners. As we navigate the journey of love after 40, we often find that the world is much larger and more vibrant than we first imagined. And in this world, there is an abundance of opportunities to meet new people and form meaningful connections. Think of your social circle as a web. The more strands you weave, the more chances you have to catch the attention of someone special. Being socially active not only enriches your life with diverse experiences, but also increases the likelihood of crossing paths with someone who shares your passions and perspectives. Consider joining clubs or organizations that pique your interest. Are you a book enthusiast? Join a book club. Do you love outdoor activities? Participate in a hiking group. The possibilities are endless. These environments offer a comfortable space to engage with like-minded individuals, making the process of meeting new people less daunting and more enjoyable. Volunteering is another excellent way to widen your social network. When you volunteer, you contribute to a cause that resonates with you, and in doing so, you're likely to meet others who are passionate about the same cause. This shared passion can act as a strong foundation for a potential relationship. Participating in community events is also a great way to expand your social circle. Whether it's a local fair, a concert, or a charity run, community events bring people together. You never know who you might meet at these gatherings. Perhaps the person standing next to you in the crowd could be the one you've been searching for. But remember, expanding your social circles isn't just about finding a partner. It's about enriching your life with new experiences, learning from others, and fostering friendships along the way. Love often finds us when we least expect it. By staying socially active, you're creating opportunities for love to find you. So step outside your comfort zone, engage in social activities and meet new people. Who knows, your next date could be just one introduction away. In this digital age, online dating has become a game changer. It opens up a world of possibilities, especially for those over 40 who are seeking to find love. Let's delve into why online dating is such a boon for mature singles. First off, there's the sheer convenience of it. You can explore the dating world from the comfort of your own home at a pace that suits you. No need to dress up, no need to spend time going to social gatherings hoping to meet someone. You can connect with potential matches while sipping your morning coffee or winding down after a long day. Then there's the vast pool of potential matches. Online dating sites and apps give you access to a wide array of individuals from various walks of life with diverse interests. This widens your horizons and gives you a higher chance of meeting someone who shares your passions, your values, or even your love for vintage records or gardening. What's more, online dating allows for communication before meeting in person. This can be a great advantage, allowing you to gauge compatibility, build a connection, and even weed out those who might not be a good fit, all before you invest time and energy into a face-to-face -face date. Now let's talk about creating an appealing online profile. It's your introduction to the world, so make it count. Be honest, be authentic, and be positive. Highlight your interests, your passions, and what you're looking for in a relationship. A good profile picture is also crucial. Choose a recent clear photo that reflects who you are. And remember, it's not about being perfect, it's about being you. 
Online dating can seem daunting, but remember, it's just another tool in your dating toolbox. Just like with any tool, the key is learning how to use it effectively. So embrace the digital age, step out of your comfort zone, and open the door to a world of potential connections. Online dating is not just for the young, but also for the young at heart. Patience and positivity are virtues in the dating world. The journey to finding love, especially when you're over 40, can feel like a bit of a roller coaster ride. There are exhilarating highs, heart dropping lows, and sometimes stretches of calm where it feels like nothing much is happening. But just like a roller coaster, it's important to stay seated and enjoy the ride. When it comes to dating, maintaining a positive attitude is crucial. You might encounter disappointments or setbacks. Maybe a promising first date didn't lead to a second, or perhaps someone you were interested in didn't feel the same way. It's easy to let these instances cloud your outlook and dampen your spirits. But remember, each setback is an opportunity to learn and grow. Instead of seeing these experiences as failures, view them as stepping stones on your journey to finding love. Every interaction, every conversation, and every date, they're all part of the process, helping you understand better what you're looking for in a partner. Patience plays an important role in this process. The society we live in is increasingly fast-paced, where we're used to getting what we want quickly and conveniently. But when it comes to matters of the heart, it's not a race. It's not about who finds love first or fastest. It's about finding the right person, someone who complements you, someone with whom you can build a meaningful and lasting relationship. So don't rush the process, take your time, enjoy the journey, get to know people, engage in meaningful conversations, explore your interests, and let things unfold naturally. Remember, love isn't something you can force or hurry. It's something that happens in its own time. Staying patient and positive doesn't mean you should settle for less than you deserve. It means understanding that good things take time. It means not letting the disappointments get you down. It means staying hopeful and open to the possibilities that lie ahead. Remember, good things come to those who wait. Let's quickly recap what we've learned today. We began by acknowledging the challenge of dating after 40. It's a unique journey filled with its own set of ups and downs, but it's certainly not an insurmountable task. It's about understanding that you're not alone in this and that it's okay to seek help and guidance. Next, we talked about redefining dating expectations. As we mature, our understanding of love and relationships evolves. It's crucial to approach dating with an open mind, leaving behind any unrealistic expectations or idealizations. Embrace the reality of dating at this stage of life with all the wisdom and experience it brings. Building confidence was our third point. Remember, confidence is the key. It's not about pretending to be someone you're not, but rather feeling comfortable in your own skin. It's about acknowledging your worth and not settling for less than you deserve. Our fourth point was about expanding social circles. New connections often lead to unexpected opportunities. Whether it's joining a club, volunteering, or attending social events, expanding your social circle can significantly increase your chances of meeting someone special. We then embraced the world of online dating. This virtual platform can be a great tool for those looking to connect with others. With an array of dating sites tailored for mature singles, it's about finding the one that suits you best and navigating it with a positive and open attitude. Finally, we emphasize the importance of practicing patience and positivity. Dating can be a roller coaster of emotions, but keeping a positive outlook and being patient can make the journey less daunting and more enjoyable. So there you have it. These strategies are designed to equip you with the tools and mindset needed to successfully navigate the world of dating after 40. Embrace them, apply them, and remember that every person you meet is a new opportunity to learn and grow. Remember, you're never too old to find love. So go out there and make your dating journey a memorable one.